approaching Byzantium. One, coping with cool, dark morning air, skimming like the vessel, but swifter. Impression of this view of dome and minaret, Islamic tip of Europe, last scrap of Suleiman the Magnificent, jewel of the secular republic, beautifully still with only muted noise of boat's engine. Two, rain in the streets making sticky mud from ancient dust, rotting like Manhattan, automobiles churning through commuter traffic and industrial chemistry, nature thriving on this seascape and perennial skyline, thriving between the streets and between and atop the bricks of ruined walls and in the surging of multitudes of workers and beasts of burden, clamoring for millennia, cynic, eternally enmeshed in carefully recorded moments called history, or left forgotten, disintegrating in the same moldy cellar sealed by the newer foundations. Three, what are the great men, those who are responsible, those who marshaled the forces, those who are serious, puppets of forces they cannot fathom? Do they serve the will of the people or the false gods they advertise? Four, framed ornately, Ataturk, glares down at a poet in Istanbul, sitting in a cafe, sipping coffee, pausing between lines and stanzas, vainly trying to create beauty from the horror of events. I do believe in God, especially when I'm troubled. The rest of the time, I can take care of myself. Mm -hmm.